what so we break it in right here so the business of huawei is on a bad stage and honestly after the initial ban Huawei was still doing all right. In fact, while the ban was active, Huawei rose to become the largest smartphone brand globally. And right after that, the US took a step further by tightening the ban. And this time around, Huawei cannot do business with non-American companies that uses American technology, which was even worse. And with this ban, Huawei's Karen cannot do business with TSMC that makes their chipsets. And you know, if there is no processor, then there is no smartphone. Like, they can't even make smartphones. So as a result, its smartphone sales have been very poor because it doesn't produce enough units. Presently though, Huawei is struggling to hold its place in the top 5 global smartphone manufacturers. The company has no choice but to use inferior chipsets produced in China. But now, it seems there is a big hope. If the latest reports are true though, then Huawei may just have a lifeline. So according to a recent report via Same Mobile, Huawei and Samsung may be in a business. The report claims that Samsung may just be Huawei's lifeline because apparently both companies have an agreement for Samsung to make Huawei's latest 5nm flagship chipsets. Well, this chip is Huawei's Karen 9000L 5G processor and it uses the 5nm manufacturing process, which is great. And if we talk about it, this Karen 9000L chipset is less powerful than the Karen 9000 because it will be way enough for mid-range or you can say upper mid-range Huawei phones. But the concept here is that Samsung is becoming Huawei's lifeline. I know you guys have tons of questions like does Samsung use American technology in its manufacturing process? Probably yes. Does Samsung have a 5nm manufacturing process that does not use American technology? Probably no. So how Samsung work for Huawei with the US ban in place? This is the most important question that has no answer for now. Like I cannot tell if Samsung has permission from US to produce the chipsets for Huawei but Samsung is working for Huawei and that's true. So let's wait and watch what will happen at the end. But hey, it's a great news. So yeah, what do you think about it? Well, let me know in the comments down below and if you somehow like this video, a sub to the channel will definitely make my day. So as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Bye -bye.